It's hot. Oh. Really? There's the hiccup. I like that. This is a special sauce, Just Lonker, and I'm very excited for you to try it. You brought water and I didn't. Yeah, you know, you never know, man. <laughs> you never know. So, uh, Bravado Spice Company. I'm sure you've had sauce. We've had this. Yeah, I'm sure you've had sauce. I recognize Bravado the before. label. I'm a big fan of Bravado. Um, so their labels are just super clean. Yeah, it's got that's all what the I remember. It's got all the information you want. They make a variety of products from spices. They make like margarita mixes. I think they make a Bloody Mary mix. I might be wrong. But they make some really, really good sauces. Some of my favorites, and James, one of the owners, sent this over a few weeks ago, and I'm excited to finally get to it. This is a very hot sauce. <laughs> uh, this is their garlic and arbol maruga scorpion hot sauce. They have very simplistic ingredients. Their flavors are very pronounced. I am very, very excited to get into this. The, the um, Akamiso is, I think, the last video that I did on Bravado, which has, which is like one of the best sauces you can put in, like ramen. I put it on sushi sometimes. It is good. Anyways, garlic and arbol. So this is the, fla the flavors you should be getting are the garlic and the arbol chilies. And then the Maruga Scorpion is just going to be ripping right the, the there. Hot, it's the going to be ripping right there. That one's got the floral taste too, doesn't it? Uh, Maruga's Scorpions? Yes. Um, they do. But we'll see how much of that you're going to get. I, th I threw one up right there. Yeah, you did. <laughs> yes, you did. Um, okay. Undeniably bold. A fiery, garlicky blend of, blend of scorpion peppers, our bold chilies, and a hint of lime. This is a true ultra-hot from deep in the heart of Texas. Ingredients are vinegar, maruga scorpion pepper, garlic, arbol, cumin, black pepper, lime juice, and salt. Very simple ingredients. Yeah, virtually no ingredients. Says right there on the bottom of it, fiery. Five out of five. One, two, three, four. Five out of five flames. It is gluten-free, it is vegan, it is fiery, it's going to be awesome. Texture is great on this. Looks very loose. Yeah, it's a thinner, it's a thinner yeah. sauce. Looks loose. I'm gonna say it's a medium-bodied sauce. <laughs> I'm gonna say uh, it's gonna be real hot. Um, I'm, ex I'm excited to see how the garlic kind of like. I, I yes, I'm excited for that. How pronounced is it gonna be? Are the arbol chilies gonna come out? I love arbols. They're like um, earthy, smoky. You seem a lot of like Tex-Mex. You know, like it's got that. It's got that vibe, you know? I've never had an herbal chili just like right off the rip. I need to check one of them out. Okay. It's got a great consistency. Ooh, it smells great. It's almost got this like, um, it's got the aroma that they have like, that there's like an olive oil or something in it. Like I can, it's weird, I can smell, I, a lot of times I can smell the, um, uh, what's the word I am looking for? Sauces like, like an emulsion, like there's like an aroma to sauces that have like this emulsion going on, and but that's not in there. Uh, anyways, I'd smell vinegar. Vinegar, scorpion, garlic. Okay. I thought I'd smell more garlic, but I'm not picking up a lot of garlic. I am. I'm getting. I get the vinegar. I can see it's interesting how both mm. of our palates kind of work. Yeah. Oh, you've already poured. I already, I poured. I already hand it to you. Yep. You've already poured. I poured. Yeah, oh better. man, this has got a beautiful. It does. It has a great consistency. Beautiful looking sauce. It just has that like deep red yep. evil look to it, with like little flecks of black pepper going on. Uh, is it dried herbal? Does it say specifically dried? The herbal chili might be dried in here. I'm not sure. Um, it just looks like a looks lot. Looks beautiful. Lot floating. Looks like a beautiful sauce. All right. Cheers. Let's see what happens, man. Ooh, that hint of lime is beautiful. Yeah, I got that citrusy taste on the back end of it. Mm. That's good. That's delicious. It's hot, but it's good. It's hot. <laughs> oh, really? There's the hiccup. I like that. There's I like the hiccup. That, man. Um. Okay. Um. Balanced. There's a lot of balance to the sauce. I love scorpion peppers. Great heat. Back of the throat. Is that you? You? I'm assuming it's you. Yeah, someone's, um, at, someone's at my door. Gotcha. <laughs> um, it's a back of the throat heat. Uh, it's about as hot as I thought it was going to be. Very it is great. back of the throat heat. You are absolutely right with that. Super hot. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> Give me the hiccup. <clears throat> it's hot. I coughed and it like, it like moved up. 
So when I'm hiccuping, I'm like bit. getting it. It's hot. <laughs> Throat burn. Spicy boy. Okay. Um, Garlicky <clears throat> taste, vinegary taste. Uh, that lime comes on the back end of it. Yep. Um, first flavor I'm getting is the combination of the garlic and the arbol. Like, they're like blending together in this like garlic, smoky, like savory, earthy <clears throat> situation. Um, not honestly, not a lot of flavor from the scorpion pepper. I, I thought I'd taste more of the scorpion, and I'm I not. I thought I would too. I'm uh, not. But I didn't. But I got the heat from it, which I love. Yeah. And then immediately after you get the hit of the lime. That lime, like, it's like right when you swallow it, it tastes like lime. Yeah, it's like, yeah, as soon as you swallow, it's like, yep. it's like when you, when you like, like do a little spritz of lime on a taco, yep. you know? Yep. And like you take a bite and then the lime hits second, it's like that exact hit. Yep. Um, and like that, that maybe the vinegar kind of like works immediately with the lime. Um, uh, a simplistic, very well balanced, ripping hot, beautiful very sauce hot. from Bravado. Um, uh, I think that this lives up to the fiery. I do um, too. This is going to go great. I I'll put this on a lot of like fatty meats and tacos and Tex Mex tacos, and tacos. All of that situation. I love it. Yeah, tacos was the first thing I thought too. Yeah, I mean this is there's not a lot of conversation that has to have about the sauce. It's no. a very literal sauce. It's exactly what it sounds like, and it's and it lives up to it. It's no just, surprises. It's just super well executed. No surprises. Um, it looks beautiful. The uh, texture is beautiful. It's it pours perfectly. The flavors are exactly on point. It's everything I've expected and seen from Bavada before. So just another knock it out of the ballpark sauce. I can't really say much more about it. I really enjoy it. So if you're looking for a super super hot sauce that's going to work well on tacos, Mexican, Tex-Mex, that situation, um, I'll lean towards this. This is a ripper. It is like a six. Six. Yeah. It's about a. a Four for me. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna we're say four. We're close. We're, we're close. close. We're close. I'm gonna go four. Um, <clears throat> anyways, in the description below is gonna be a link to Bravado, so that way you can check these out. Um, this is a fantastic. It's a very special sauce. Um, I don't do a lot of videos on only one sauces, and I wanted to make sure that I did the sauce justice because I was really looking forward to it. Beautiful. Um, also linked to Justin's RC channel. Um, did you guys watch the the video that I hinted at the last time he was on? <laughs> because you should have, because he jumped over a freaking what, is it a lake? Is, it, is that how what you would define um, it as? Someone someone commented and called it Goose Poop Creek, and I liked that. So okay. he jumped a, his his RC car over a over jump over what it got Goose, Goose poop? poop Creek. Goose Poop Creek. <laughs> so if you want to see that, which you should, you should click on the link in the description to go to his channel. Okay. Hope you enjoyed. See you guys in the next. Hey, this is Brian Ames. Uh, please click the subscribe button that you see right there, and uh, you'll subscribe to my videos. Uh, from now on, I'm going to be eating a lot of peppers. It's going to, oh man, it's going to be great. Bye.